welcome to Whiskey XP, where we level up with you. We believe that whiskey is the jewel of all beverages, as video games are the spectacle of all games. Like you, we enjoy a little drama whilst diving into our games and in good cheer. We don't claim to be experts, but want to share what we learn with you. If you're looking for an honest attempt at an unbiased whiskey review and an inside peek into a video game, then you've come to the right place. All experience levels are welcome here, newbies and vets alike. Now, let's get into it. Alright guys, so today we're going to be drinking some... Kayo Mizunar Oak Cash Strength and playing some Lost Judgment on the PlayStation 5 once again. Um, we also got some new mics here, so hopefully our audio has improved. Um, my wife's getting around to pouring some of that, Kyle. But in the meantime, um, on the screen we got um, Yagami and Kaito going into, I think it's a, a Chinese restaurant here. And um, Maybe a, a small spoiler, but if you don't want it to get spoiled, you don't have to read the, sub, the subtitles, but um, I think the graphics look pretty awesome in this game. Um, a little note about the whiskey. Hey, babe. Oh, thanks. So you got that poured quick. <laughs> so it's a cash strength. Uh, it's Mizunar Oak. Um, yeah. Unchill filtered and malted barley. Also, Kayo means ocean in Japanese. Um, this is all from the official site. Um, I'm gonna go in for the nose here. Okay. Yeah, and this is, um, we haven't tried any Mizunara, right? Yeah, we have. We have? We have. Okay. Here. So. But we'll, we'll discuss that in a later. Well, we tried the seven, the same brand. Oh, that was also. It, I think it's also oil. That's right. I'm, I'm gonna tell you right now. Not crazy about the smell on this one. No. Yeah. It's it's you'll see when you when okay. you get to it. Um, I'm trying to I'm trying to uh trying to place the words on it. Um, are you on the nose yet? Just about. Sorry, I'm trying to make sure that. No, no. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to give some other. sort of description of it. Okay. Okay. It's it's like um. It's like wet. Like, like, uh... Oh, moss. Yeah. Like it wet moss. There you go. It's kind of lighter, though. That's exactly what it is, though. Yeah? Yep. It's like wet moss. But it's a little flowery. It has that Japanese flowery note. I'm just getting the wet moss. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna go in for the taste. Um, if, if you want, you can talk about the new, um... Oh, yes. This is our new, um... Our new display here, uh, our motorized display. So, here's the game that we're playing. We thought we'd make some more usefulness of our space here. <laughs> right. Okay. Okay. This is cool. Um. Wow. Are you on the taste? Yeah, I'm. I'm absorbing. Okay. So, it tastes peated. Oh, that's it's a bit peppery for me. Peppery? Yeah. Well, I this get, one's. I get uh, peat, like the um, I get like a smoky, like a smokiness, but um. Okay, let me get acclimated. But once again, guys, this is cash strength Kayo whiskey, Japanese Mizunar oh, oak, like. uh, unchilled, filtered, and it's fifty-three percent alcohol by volume. Um, the back of the bottle says it's produced by. Um. Kayo, and it says, let's say here, Edobori Center Building, Edobori Nishi Ku Osaka, Japan. It's exactly how you say it, too. Yeah, <laughs> I butchered it. On the screen, um, th I thought this was pretty cool in the game. They made uh, Yagami, he can, he can skate, he's a skate, he can skateboard. Oh, yeah, it was like Tony Hawk. <laughs> it's like Tony Hawk. Um, it's not as good as Tony Hawk, guys. <laughs> But, but it, it was cool. It's still pretty cool. I, I appreciate it. <laughs> Except for the part where the car hits me right here. <laughs> Jeez. Anyway. Um, um, I get peated too. It's kind of simple for me. I'm struggling to pick up other notes. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know why it kind of hit me hard tonight. Um, but I get peated. Okay, I get, I get the smokiness, the peat. And I get a little bit of vanilla. A tiny bit of vanilla. It's, yeah, is it like a hint? I will say it's kind of creamy too. Like uh, it, the um, it has a nice. I like the mouthfeel, the viscosity. 
yeah, I get a subtle, a little bit of creaminess. It's, it's still a little peppery for me. I'm not sure why. Let me go in for another taste and see if I get that pepper. Like, my, uh, my tongue is kind of numb. Mm. I don't know, um, I'm not sure. Um, that might be from the proof, you know. Anyway, I think we got our first impressions, right? Yeah. All right, let's move on to some memes and highlights, guys. Let's go. A lot of you guys been telling me I gotta go check out Chinatown in Yokohama, which is one of the... Something's speaking. Cause it's Chinatown! Uncle Roger excited! So, yarareta! Chair style. Hey, this is the history of my country. Priceless pieces of Chinese New Year. Alright guys, and we're back. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed those memes. And here on the screen we got Yagami, he's skateboarding. And he's gonna go into a Korean restaurant. But as he gets there, we're gonna go back into the nose on this and get a little more tasting. Guys, you gotta try this. Yep. <laughs> This Kayo cash strength um Japanese Mizunara oak. So I think all of Kayo it sounds like they they use Mizunara for like all of their all of their bottlings. Yeah, yeah I think so. Um on the screen here real quick we have some uh, Korean cuisine, which my wife is uh, extremely familiar with since she's half Korean. And we're gonna be ordering some beef bulgogi here. It's one of our uh, favorite dishes. But um <laughs> Onto the nose on this whiskey. What did you say it smelled like earlier? It's well, it's been totally like way developing. So um, I was getting more of a, the sweetness was getting sweeter for me, and um, then I narrowed it down. I got butter, mm -hmm. so I get like a butter, and then it's kind of developed into like a pudding, like a vanilla pudding, um, but maybe like with a little bit of tang, like kind of like lemon meringue. Well, oh. well, you missed to tell them the one thing that we both all got. Alright, alright. But then, after that, I got show you. Show you or soy sauce, guys. Soy sauce. It smells so much like soy sauce to me. Right, because you were, you were getting something like, I can't tell it's something like Japanese, like a dish. And it was like the show you that's jumping out. And before we elaborate on that, um, we got Yagami, Yagami-san going into an arcade here. Oh yeah. And he's gonna play a crane game real quick. Um, <laughs> if you want to talk about that. Babe. Yeah, no, I wanted to mention, guys. Do you know anyone who actually wins and actually gets the stuffed animal or the toy? <laughs> because I didn't know there was before I met my husband, but he's actually pretty good. Like he got me, I don't know, maybe like three different things and like you know different like stuffed animals. He's got my niece some stuffed animals, but it's possible. Guys yeah, those, win. Th those games are fun for me, but um, <laughs> except for the fact that you know sometimes you lose a lot of money. But um, <laughs> anyway, let's get back to the whiskey here. And then um, so like we like we both agreed upon, it, it uh, smells a lot like uh, shoyu or soy sauce. Right. That's the that's the prominent note. But there's more than that. It's like before we got to the shoyu where we narrowed it down, it was like mushroomy mm -hmm. um what else was i getting it was like 
you know, it's, it's like, like the dish like oden, oden. Right, right. It's, I think that's like the Japanese hot pot. Right. Um, they put like daikon, and I know like they'll make it decorative and put like carrots and they like any sort of they put like fish cake and stuff. But yeah, it's, um, it's like a lot of vegetables. Um. Yeah, but so I'm thinking daikon, like the vegetables. Yeah, daikon is a, a like, type of radish. Um. Like kimchi is made from radish. Right, right. That's cabbage too. Though, or right? cabbage. Well, I guess it's a different one. Anyway, I guess the point we're trying to say is that um, we eat a lot of authentic Asian food. And this whiskey really has a lot of that smell. And even on the taste, I tasted it again. And it tastes, it has like that soy sauce kind of taste. Yeah, it's like, it makes, you know, it makes you wonder, like, so. Well, back back to the Oden, right? Yeah. So I, I have, I'm part Japanese. I have some Japanese blood. Um, but I've, I've eaten a lot of, um, authentic Japanese dishes. Oden, my grandma used to make a really good Oden. And we eat some, a little more, it's peculiar the word I'm looking for, like uh, peculiar dishes, I guess. Like really authentic. Like, like natto, which is fermented soybeans. Um, and there's some other some other different things out there. I know everyone's familiar with sushi and um, some other more mainstream things. But this um, this whiskey has that, <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. It's like that Asian cuisine. Yeah, the Asian cuisine and I guess soy and sauce. Glass. Yeah, soy sauce is the thing. Is the is what um, for sure both uh, Korean and Japanese cuisine share, right? Is yeah. soy sauce. Yeah. Sure. yeah, for sure. But and it's I get like, that in this. It makes me cuz like we got like mushrooms. Mm -hmm. um, it's like I wonder if like um, you know like Japanese mushrooms grow in like Mizunara forest or mm, I don't yeah, know how yeah. common they are but like, like there's some like it's all related like that taste profile I see what you're saying it's really cool and then, but then again the, the whiskey still has those notes of um those mm. desserty flavors that you actually got you picked up a lot on that babe yeah I barely get it it's strange it bounces for me but I'm really biased towards this because I really like you know like Ja single. Japanese and Korean food and this reminds me of that yeah so for me this is a this is a win-win for me like you give me some you know some any of those foods we like to eat and right you know to specify I don't know what kind of food would I like with this definitely some kind of Korean barbecue um, or just like even like a soup like a Japanese soup like, like a miso like soup a, yeah or like a New Year soup Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Fair, it's ozoni, ozuni? Yeah. Ozoni, I think. Or the Korean Yeah, the Korean soup, soup New Year's soup is good too. It's, it's a, a good whiskey. whiskey. Yeah. It's growing on me. Then again, initially when we first tried it, I was a little put off, guys, because I was not expecting this. You were getting like the, um, the wet logs in the forest. Oh, you said wet logs, <laughs> wet moss. And on top of that, the last couple of whiskeys we've been opening, uh, including a Japanese whiskey, tasted and smelled a lot like a traditional bourbon. Yeah. So I was not expecting, this must be the Mizunar oak, like you said. Yeah. In this Kyle. Awesome this is, stuff. Like, super cool, guys. Like, you gotta check this out. <laughs> oh, yeah, man, we can't say, any, like, any more good things about it. It's really awesome. Then again, do you want to talk about the one we really like, or you want to save yeah, it for later? Yeah, mention it. Okay, so there is, um, I think it's the Kyle, the single, the seven. Seven years, it's yeah. It's aged for seven years at sea. So that's the only other Kyle we've had. Correct. That bottle is awesome. Hopefully we can... Yeah, maybe we'll review it. Get around to reviewing it one day. But but we got this one because we really like the single, the seven year. Right, right. So, so Actually, this was a... Um, this was a Christmas gift, right? Yes. From my parents. Yes. And my parents hooked us up with this one. Thank you. Yeah, thanks guys. Thanks mom <laughs> and dad. Um, um, and yeah, yeah they kind of, can't remember how much they spent. <sighs> Maybe it's like standard Japanese whiskey or whiskey from Japan. Um, yeah, it's another controversial topic guys, especially <laughs> with the Japanese. To be honest. Well, I mean, looking it up, it's hard to tell. Um, right. I mean, I'm sure, I bet, if we could speak Japanese and we 
you know, search the Japanese web, then there's probably a lot of information, but you know what I mean? Yeah, maybe. I bet we could find a bunch of information. I bet they're really proud of, you know, their distilleries. And well, I don't, I, apparently the website on this, the official website says they don't have a distillery yet. Yeah, so we, we couldn't, we'll just be honest with you guys, we, we know it's from Japan, but we, we don't know details. We don't know the details, and it's kind of murky on, on the official site, so... But we know we love it. Yeah, <laughs> Whatever so it is, this is amazing. Whatever, yeah, Kayo, you guys, the corporation, the company, you guys are doing a damn good job. Yes, please keep uh, doing, like, the exact same thing. We'll be happy for many years. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, so what else do you want to say about it? Um... Yeah, no, I just, like, the nose on this is so complex, like, I really struggled at the start. It's so soy sauce, so show you to me. Yeah, it's really weird. How about, how about this? Show me, show you, Kiko man, Kiko man. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. In case you guys didn't see the commercial. Don't worry, Kiko man's my hero. <laughs> um, you want to give this a rating, then? Yeah. Um. What do you want to do, babe? Something high. I trust you. This is... Guys, you gotta try this. Um, like, I want to give it like 8.5, like honestly. I'm with you. I totally this, agree. This stuff is like, this is gold. Here's the jewels and the glass. The jewels and the logo, This you is, mean? this is. <laughs> the jewels and the logo, Yes, right? yeah. in our logo. This is why we're here. This is what we mean. Liquid gold, guys. Liquid gold. If, if you guys want to know what we meant. All right, guys. So, the Kyle uh, cash strength, right? Kyle's yep. cash strength yep. um, is going to be an 8.5 Whiskey XP Stars. Um, thank you guys once again for joining us. Um, yes. If you like this content, um, please like and subscribe so you don't miss any future whiskey reviews and video game pairings. Um, we're going to try to spice it up a little more as we continue along this path um, and feel free to drop your feedback guys yes please always drop some feedback um yeah, all right guys thank you for joining us and we'll see you next time take care